everything situated here in the deer blind opening day deer season in michigan november 15th every single year haven't missed this in 34 years now it's i mean it's it's tough to explain it's a special holiday here and time for us together as a family so this morning i'm hunting by myself and then this afternoon i've got my daughter michelle that's going to come out and sit with me now unfortunately the weather's supposed to be nasty high winds and rain throughout the day so not sure what the deer movement's going to be but this time of year just being in the deer blind it's special smokes it's been raining like crazy this morning but there's been a lot of deer movement and i was watching three does that have been out in front here for it seems like about 40 minutes and all of a sudden over to my right i caught a couple of does coming and then right behind him was a big buck quickly got the camera all set up moved over and he was pushing them through this lane and got a shot off and he dropped right in the lane not exactly sure how good footage i got because i just set the camera up for that general direction to be able to zoom or anything get all worked up with white tails obviously i probably could have but I'm gonna give them just a minute here. Go take a look at them. I'm just walking out here. To take a quick peek at them, then get back in the blind. It's prime time, so I don't want to be moving around messing it up for anybody else that's out right now. Here in a second. West Michigan, eight point on opening day. Pretty sweet. I'm gonna tuck back in the blind now and wait a little bit. Hopefully it doesn't rain too much here. Yeah, that's awesome. I'm gonna take a look, see the blind behind me. Not that far a shot, but it's thick Michigan hunting. So this is about typical. Oh, it's just got everything out of the blind. I'm gonna go do pictures and film with this buck real quick while well, we got a break in the rain and get them loaded and back to the cabin. So Shelly's gonna come out with me this afternoon. We're gonna sit in that same blind where I shot out of this morning, same blind where I hunt every year and where Shelly shot that funky buck at during youth season. Yeah, pretty sweet morning here in Michigan. On November 15th, opening day of deer season every year in Michigan. Haven't missed one in a long, long time and don't plan on ever missing one until I can't move again. Nasty weather this morning. Caught a little break and during that break, deer just started moving all over the place and caught this guy chasing three does through my west shooting lane. Got the camera adjusted on him and made a, made a quick shot, but he's all rutted up. I'm gonna take care of him now and a little break in the weather, so I'm gonna take care of him and then get my daughter Michelle back out. This is the same stand behind me that Michelle shot that freaky buck out of earlier this year and I've hunted out of for the last, and since I was in high school, over 20 years ago. Hunted out of the same blind. Michigan hunting traditions right there.
I was just getting back in the blind and situated. Shelly, already locked in over here, ready to rock and roll. The weather outside is insane with rain and 35 to 40 mile an hour gust. So it's gonna be an interesting afternoon. idea how big this deer is until you see it up close oh holy smokes Shelly just smoked a big eight I think it came out of here there have been does around us all night <clears throat> and I looked out and this guy was coming through the pines and just had to wait shot and he bucked he didn't come through our other shooting lane so just gonna give him a couple minutes here and then we're gonna sneak out oh Shelly oh that was a big deer I've got a bunch of trail cam pics of that deer kiddo well, we're just heading out, giving it about 30 minutes after Shelly shot. Watched the replay a bunch of times. It was a weird angle and maybe a touch high, but he never came out my other shooting lane in the direction he took off. I think he would have. What do you think, Shelly? That, that was a big one. That was a big deer. We've got a bunch of trail cam pics of this deer. All right, so we're going to go to where he. It is the biggest deer we have on our property. The biggest deer we had on our property. We're walking to where we shot right now. All right, you shot over here, kiddo. But he was standing somewhere, would have been right here, because you're in the lane. So let's look down and see if we can't find blood. Maybe he was back farther, Shelly. Some briars, I do. Oh my God. What do you see? Camera. Cut the camera. No, we keep the camera rolling, kiddo. Watch out for that. Watch out for that branch. Ooh, Shelly, oh, he looks like a good one. Pretty sweet deer, Shelly. Oh, that's the one I got a bunch of trail cam pics of. You bet. Look at a heck of a Michigan deer right there. So opening day here in Michigan, November 15th. I got out this morning, was able to take a eight point, came right back to the same blind with Shelly this afternoon and shot an eight point. Miss Lucky here only sat for about an hour and a half. And it was a downpour and about 40 mile an hour winds and still, Got an absolute stud of an eight point here in Michigan. Got a ton of trail cam pictures of this guy. Just symmetrical, nice brows. Awesome West Michigan deer. And how many deer have you got this year? Three. Three deer. So one in Kentucky, one in youth season here, and then opening day of rifle season. 
nice eight. Good hug, kiddo. Love you. I'm proud of this little girl right here. This is what it's all about. Homegrown, hunting at home with family and friends. Love you, kiddo. Why are you on your knees? Because I don't want to go on my butt. You taller than me? Yeah. Until I stand up. So Shelly's been using this Gunworks ever since she was, how old, you, how old were you when you shot your first deer? Six or seven. I think it was six. Shelly was six in Kentucky and she's been using this gun for the last five years. Have you ever missed? Shelly's never missed in the field. How many people can say that? You get excited after? Yeah, she gets a little excited after. Pretty awesome. All right, it's all you, take care of them, I'm out. Well, that was a heck of an opening day here of rifle season in Michigan, November 15th every year. And this will be the last episode of Homegrown for a while because we're out of deer tags and turkey season's over. You know what? Maybe we'll get a get a duck episode in or something. Yeah. Proud of you, kiddo. Hunting in West Michigan, where I was born and raised, where this little minion's born and raised. She's gonna stay here, she says. Makes her daddy proud. That's why she gets whatever she wants. Oh.